Hi everyone, I am back with a D-Stash. This is US only, PayPal only, friends and family. This is for uh, paper D-Stash and it is $40 shipped. Um, so I'm gonna start out with the paper that is, paper pads or collection that are complete and brand new. So, hold on. I guess I wasn't ready. Okay, hold on. Okay, so we'll go with the first one. Sorry about moving that around. This is a Doodle Bug 6x6 paper pad day to day. It is all there. It comes with 24 double sided um, pattern paper. That's what this looks like. The next one is 49 and Market. The art, I don't even know how to say this. Art Options Spice 6x6 uh, paper pad. And this is a new new um, collection. This is brand new. I looked at them, but I didn't... Um, I just looked at them, put them back in there. So that's that. This is a Julie Nutting uh, paper doll collection. It's 10 sheets of 12x12 double-sided paper and two sheets of 12 by 12 stickers and this is brand new I, I don't even think I opened it to look at them and I can't remember how why I bought this or, or anything like that but. so the stickers on the back the next one is simple stories 12 by 12 uh, pet shop cat I the reason why is I thought this was the dog one. I grabbed the wrong one. Didn't I just didn't bother to return it because I thought, well, you know, maybe I'll use it, but I, I'm not. I'm, I know I'm not. I ended up getting the dog one, <laughs> but I'm, I know I'm not going to use the cat ones because I just I don't have cats. It is cute though. That's the sticker sheet. The next one. You know what? This one's brand new. This is um, Have Faith by Echo Park. I think this is brand new anyway. way. There's that one. Pattern papers. These are the stickers. Okay, so the next, um, I have this one. It's called Country or Christmas Dreams by Country Craft Creations. I know I'm not going to use this. Um, I did use a couple of sheets out of here, um, but that's it. This would make a really beautiful um, December daily or or a Christmas album. So, I mean, I'm not going to take it all out, but but it's it's really pretty. I, I just I have too much Christmas. So there's that one. Okay, so the next one I have, this is by DCWV, the Christmas and Winter Rhinestone stack. I did use some of these um, because there's a page on each in each sleeve on the front and back. And as you can see, there's none there. Ugh. So there's that one, there's one there, this one's empty, there's this one, just I used some border strips on this one, uh, I used some of this sheet and put the rest back in, there's nothing on that side, there's this sheet, there's nothing on that side, and then there's this sheet. And then another one on the back. And these are great for um, scrapbook layouts, which is what I use mine for. Okay, the next one is this Doodlebug 6x6 paper pad. It's uh, Dragon Tails, and it says 24 double-sided, but I believe there's 22 think in here so 
apparently I used a couple of sheets. Those are the pattern papers for that one. This is a beautiful one, Time to Flourish. This is the um, calendar. Let me open it so I can show you each page. So there's cutouts for each of the month. This is for January. That's the back. But the floral part is gone from January. Here's February. That's the back of February. This is the floral page of February. That's the back. March. I don't have the floral part of March. Uh, here's April. That's the back of April. That's the floral part of April. And the back of that page. Here's May. Back of that, but the floral part of May is gone. This is the cutouts for June. The back of June. There's no floral page for that one. July. That's the back of July. There's the floral page for July. The back of July. There's August. The back. The floral page for August. that. Here's September. The back of that. The floral page for September. The back of that. Here's the cutouts for October. Here's the back of that. The floral page for October. The back of that. Cutouts for November. Here's the back of that. Here's the floral page for November. And the back of that. And there's no cutouts for December, but the floral page for December is here. And then there's the back of that. So there's that. So this is meant to be, I don't know if you can see, like to make a calendar. So they have, there's paper pads that have the, the actual calendar page to write the numbers in there for the days. Or you can just use these to make cards and projects and things. Okay, so the next one is this collection. This one is Floral Shop by Graphic 45. And I looked at this and it looks like I used one full page. I don't know which page I used. And then the rest of the pages, I punched out hearts like on maybe five sheets at the bottom, like four or five hearts at the bottom. And then there's another sheet that looks like maybe I used half of it. Um, but the, basically the collection is pretty much all here, all the paper. Um, did not use any of the same as you can see there's a piece right there I did not use any of the stickers from the sticker page I did not use any of the chipboard pieces and then there's the journaling and ephemera cards um, they're supposed to be 32 but there is 28 so apparently I used 4 the next one is um, Graphic 45's Couture. This is not a full collection, just letting you know. This is just scraps. But there are some cutouts, as you can see. Okay, kind of stuff there. So there's cutouts here, you know, in the cutout pages. So, I mean, you can easily make cards with these. Um, 
again, you know, there's scraps. So again, this is not a full collection. These are just scraps. Let's see. Um, the next one and last one is a Prima uh, paper pad and it is the lavender paper pad. As you can see, I have scraps in the back. But there is still a lot of paper in here. Paper and cutouts and yeah. So, okay, so this is all of the paper um, for this D stash and it is $40 uh, shipped. This will go in a medium flat rate box. If you are interested, please email me at craftygirl, C-R-A-F-T-E-E g-u-r-l at gmail.com if it is available i'll let you know and i'll ask you to send payment this is us only paypal only friends and family okay thank you